Good morning, everyone. It is breakfast time, brunch time, whatever you want to call it time here. Um, I've been up super, super early. I made couscous, macaroni and cheese, um, some burger with some vegetables, and made all of that up for the chickens and the dogs this morning. Everybody was really, really happy. I've already been out to the goats. I've already changed out their water, gave them fresh hay, um, gave them some pellets, and next I'll be cutting up fruit for them this afternoon. Um, anyway, my whole thing is, is right here I have an orange, and right here I have a banana. And so what we're going to do is we're going to look at the yellows of my eggs, and I'm going to see who is lacking what. Now, going into winter, we know that they're going to be lacking um, fresh greens, except for what I give them. And this is how I know what I need to do to bring them up during the winter. So all of these eggs have been gathered in the past uh, four days. So this is what I've gathered in four days. And I, and I do have four of these. And um, a few of my eggs have frozen. And so, you know, obviously those went to Solomon while I was outside, or I came in and let them fall and get into these great veins. But first off, we're going to look at one of the Bantam eggs and see what they look like. Okay, so now, whoops, the orange rolled away. Okay, so. It's closer to the banana, and I would like to see a little more orange to it. So my little bantams need greens really, really bad. Okay. All right, so let's dump that one over there. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick an egg from a different coop. Now, this one here is one of my my hatched eggs and it is huge. Look at it compared to a Bantam egg. It's absolutely huge. I almost think this might be a double yoker which is why I really wanted to check it. So let's check this nice blue egg and see what we have. Oops, a little shell in there. A lot of white really nice sized yolk in there. Let me get the shell out. Let me look at the color. The color looks to be a little more orange. So. Ah. Okay. So let's look and see what this one looks like. This one is just a little more orange. This is not as orange as I like my eggs to be. So obviously, you know, they're missing on those greens right now. But look how big that yolk is compared to the little Bantam yolk. Okay, so the Bantam does look a little darker, but I think it's because it's consolidated more. But let's look at another one. Okay, so we know that one. The Bantams are up in the, the chicken barn, and... Um, the, the chicken that laid the blue egg, which is either um, chickpea or one of um, the, uh, what I call spitfires. I have two of those. So let's go ahead and look at um, our mama bird. This here is our, this came from our mama bird, I think. Yes. So let's check and see what we got here. Well, it looks really pale. Okay, it's comparison. Still brighter than the orange, but not as orange as the orange. Which you're not going to, I mean, I have gotten them really, really orange. Okay. Now, I want to try another bird. Okay, let's see here. Um, I'm going to try this huge one here. This is absolutely huge. Look at it compared to a Bantam egg. Look at that. 
Um, so let's go ahead and try this other big one. Oh, now see, this one's really orange. So this chicken here is getting a little more of her greens. You can see right where I like it. That's not a bad egg for a winter egg at all. So let's go ahead and put that all together. And you can see the difference. See this one? See how much darker it is. Okay. All right, let's do one more egg. Um, I want to try someone who is up in the barn that I've been trying to supplement really, really well. So I think it's going to be this one here. Nice sized egg. This is from one of the chickens that I bred. It was either BB, PJ Pajama Bottoms, or Anna Banana. Those three are together, and this is where this egg came from. So let's look at it. Okay. I think that's right around, not quite as orange as the last one, but it's still got a nice deep yolk. And they're going to be real. I wish I had a store-bought egg um, because I would show you how even more pale than a banana they are. It, I'm not used to seeing them, and when I buy them, it's really hard. All right. There you go. But what a beautiful array of colored eggs. I mean, just beautiful eggs. All right, you go. Y'all have a great day. Stay warm. It was uh, six below zero before the sun came up, and I think we're supposed to get up to 23. Oh, my goodness. It's going to be a heat wave. All right, y'all. Stay warm. Stay safe. And please check on those you love. Bye, y'all. Hugs from a distance.